heart start beat fast with excitement as my walk through band finals game. I was finally in St. Tillis and I couldn't wait to fight my way to some juicy pan chicken. The venue was huge and this place was called Independence Park. The first thing I saw was a huge stage and nothing that jump on it. The sponsors was out in them numbers. There was Coca-Cola, True Juice, Copperwood Pork and Caribbean Passion. Who did I give out? And even Walker's Wood was there. Oh yeah, I'm a ass was it Jane. But now as I eat my food, I see a slice of bread down. Now, after mingling with the good people like me, try to convince to all the judges to tell me who the winners was and trying as much of the contestants pan chicken as I could couldn't believe CB do all this for free I mean there was a health wellness center a park park endless rides for the kids and as night fall I'ma take the show was over that's where the niceness start Miss Kitty was blazing up the stage and then finally start to announce who the winners there was a sauce boss winner for who made the best sauce. the second runner up won $700,000 and as the intensity built for see who was the final winner it turned out to be a lady named Tatalin McDonald when she started well, some accidentally get in my eye. I never know this lady, but I was so happy for her. And just when I was about to go to my yard, I hear some performances that are going on. I couldn't believe the show never done. There was performances from Joshi, Lali, Shot, and Tali, and even Chris Martin. And this was some top class performance. Shout out to CB for bringing this to St. Elizabeth. To add a little smile to the people them face after such a devastating hurricane. All I know, I can't wait for pan next year, cause you know me after that.